Well, hey! Hello. It's been a while, huh? Sorry to keep you waiting. Ah, right. How is everyone? This is strange. OBS has not been happy with me today. I've been, like, resizing windows, telling it to go on this monitor, game on the other monitor. And it's just not having any of it. It's like, oh, now you want to stream with me? Hmm. Yeah, it's not been a very happy bunny. But I think everything's working now. So bear with me if there's any teething problems. Yeah, uh, I hope you all like Mini Kazia down there in the, in the bottom right. He's loving it though. He's hanging out with all the beetles in this tea leaf forest that I have created for you. Yeah, let me know if you like the new overlays. I've been working pretty hard on them all week. Don't feel too bad if they suck. It was kind of a... There was an ulterior motive to it. Uh, since I've been working in game design and development, I've been looking for excuses to practice 2D art, graphic design, a bit of animation, and... Getting back into streaming kind of killed two birds with one stone. I got to make all these graphics. I've made a couple of emotes that you should be able to use once you unlock them with bits. Yeah, it's all good. And yeah, I'm going to be improving stuff as we go along. I can't believe in these last seven months, I actually got a couple of followers. Woo! Yeah, so thank you to Hina Kawaii Zero. The name is scrolling really slowly. That's a second zero. We're gonna go for a third one? No. And then the other one was Minimo. So yes, thank you to you two. <laughs> you you joined at the wrong time, but I'm back now. I'm back! <laughs> watching what is the media you have been consuming by diktat of our overlords cultural overlords disney uh, is boning yes there we go <laughs> we okay that should have updated. Oh, little... <laughs> I'm going to keep little Kazia in the bottom right. He's not leaving. I refuse to tarnish his memory like that. Ah! Okay. A very different type of game. Uh, it is one that presents... Other problems, you see the modding community for this game has been amazing. You know, any new rhythm game that comes out, you know somebody's going to put All Star in it. You know somebody's going to put Megalovania. <laughs> you got to get all the meme songs in there. Problem is, I don't know how many of those I can play without the music industry coming for me and trying to put my head on a spike. So we'll see what we can get away with. The video game tracks should be fine. And all of the tracks in the main game are public domain because these are indie developers. We can't really expect them to just walk up to Taylor Swift and say, hi, I want your music. <laughs> Problem is I probably suck at this game more than I do Tekken, which would really be saying something. Okay, you can probably hear some tooting going on. Let's bring that up here, shall we? Ew. <laughs> oh no. Honestly, not playing much, trying to complete various Switch games. 
Ah, uh, yes. The finishing, but not 100%ing. As long as they're games where playing 100% is fun, then yeah, I can get behind that. But there are some games where you're like, playing to 100% is going to make me enjoy this game a whole lot more. Completely tarnish my opinion of it. You know, I don't want anyone to play Breath of the Wild to 100% and get all of those Korok seeds. <laughs> hey, Sir Newt! I was wondering how many of the, the old guard were going to show up today. In fact, when I was planning on coming back to streaming, I believed that I got a notification saying you've got a Discord channel now. So you're obviously still in the game. You're doing well. Yeah, yeah, I've I've been good. I develop video games now. <laughs> yeah, lots has a lot has changed. But yeah, I can elaborate on that. When I actually get into a damn video game, and we'll talk about it naturally. Oh, you're playing Xenoblade 2? Hell yes. Yeah, Xenoblade Chronicles is my favourite RPG of all time. It's a top five game for me. Still trying to decide whether I like one or three the best. Three is absolutely phenomenal. Two is still very good. Uh, it definitely does some does some things that I'm not a huge fan of. But yeah, like the core thing of falling in love with these goofball characters. Uh, Monolith Soft is still pretty good at that, no matter which number you put after the Chronicles. You know, they're already good in that regard. Trombone Champ is not showing up as a window in OBS. <laughs> Those are some monster games, though. I understand if you've not played all of them just yet. They're all 100 hours apiece. They are scary. Ah, Trombone Champ is actually showing up. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. Copyright Strike Speedrun Challenge. Let's -a go. Yeah, how are you finding Xenoblade Chronicles 2? And have you... Am I taking it you played the first one? Trombone chap. Yeah, and with a game like JRPG, you really want to set aside a couple of hours to get stuff done. So, this is Trombone Champ. Uh, you may notice that my music list looks a little different <laughs> from the base game that you might have seen. Yeah, yeah, this person looks pretty swaggy. <laughs> let's, let's go with them. You've never played the first? Oh! Lizzie, what are you doing? What are you doing with your life? <laughs> no, if anything, that just makes me more jealous because it means... You're still yet to experience it through fresh eyes. Okay. Let's do a lovely little warm up. <laughs> Let's actually do something that's in the base game to start with, shall we? Let's, um... <laughs> because I'm British... Surely it's got to be God Save the King. <laughs> yeah, a lot of national anthems in this game. Public domain. You don't have to pay a penny. I'm also aware that I'm going to go very quiet while playing this because it gets intense. So I guess it's a bit like a concert. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Also, uh, this game may have originally released uh, when we did not have a king, but a queen. <laughs> so they actually had to make an update to change the song title to God Save the King, <laughs> which I think is the best patch note I've ever read. <laughs> The images in the background kill me. Oh no! My combo. Glorious beans on toast. I hate baked beans. <laughs> I really did go. Ah! Oh, I really don't get why people like them. <laughs> the best patch note ever. Updated the name of the British National Anthem to reflect uh, the state of the monarchy. <laughs> that was right next to uh, general bug fixes and frame rate issues. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you basically had the full experience. There was Big Ben, there were baked beans. It was all there. Also, while I'm playing a game that actually cooperates with me, I'm going to move that chat over a bit. Because it's going to bug me. Oh. Oh, oh. Game. Ew, okay. <laughs> Maybe that's the best I can do. Yeah, do tell me if things start looking a bit funky for any reason. Have any of you played this game? Newt, have you played this game or heard anything about it? It is surprisingly difficult. Um, and I think the hardest thing about it is getting those really quick, short notes because you can press a button on your keyboard, but you can also hit the left mouse button. And the problem is, the more you do that, the more your wrist is going to slide a bit. If you play for too long, your wrist is going to start aching a lot. So yeah, you might accidentally miss some notes. <laughs> Zarathustra is very funny. Who's watched 2001 A Space Odyssey? In fact, basically the whole soundtrack to that film is in this game. So what do we think this song looks like? Oh! <laughs> it's also an incredibly funny game. I love how you don't get penalized for tooting away. Oh god. <laughs> and those slides where you have to move the mouse really quickly between notes, those are a killer. Oh, there's the rest of the song. I'm going to run out of breath, which is a mechanic. <laughs> uh. Oh, gosh. Bravo, bravo. Beautiful. The game audio is quiet, by the way. That, thank you for telling me, that can be fixed quite easily. I guess because before I was doing the sound test uh, for Tekken 7. <laughs> it sounded pretty okay there. Uh, but I guess now we're playing a game that is quite heavily focused on the music. It would be quite nice to hear it. 
Okay, let me know if this is any better. Okay, that's enough of the boring base game tracks. We want to dive into the modding community. Much better, cool. And you can still hear me okay? I'm honestly not gonna be talking that much during <laughs> these harder tracks anyway. Okay, which one of these is gonna get me copyright struck the least? I'm gonna, <laughs> gonna work my way up to the harder ones. Ah, oh. <laughs> ah, oh, yes. O Canada, next to Green Hill Zone. Balanced as far as I can tell. Thank goodness, something is going right, finally. Okay, so next to the likes of Beethoven and Mozart, we have Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> okay, this is quick. Oh, no, I've lost it. Got stage fright. What's quite nice. Oh. What's quite nice about this game is that sucking makes it infinitely more funny. <laughs> Oh, no. I didn't even attempt to get that one. <laughs> it's not good. I'm sorry, Yuji Naka. I failed you. And now just to hear what I'm actually playing. Ah, that was awful. I'm surprised it's a B to be honest. <laughs> the Canadian national anthem, Green Hill Zone. Place is pretty green, pretty lush. Okay, okay. I think half the challenge of this game is going into the options and tweaking the sensitivity so you can comfortably move the pointer up and down and make those really big slides. From like a really low note to a really high one, vice versa. I'm not sure I've found it yet because every time I think I've found it, I come across another bastard of a song that's just all over the place. Yeah, I think what's really good about this game is that it seems to punish you more for not clicking enough notes instead of where the note actually is. So this game really wants you to try. <laughs> Also, I love how this makes you play the vocals. <laughs> A classic gaming anthem. <laughs> 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 
Nasty! <laughs> yeah, so like for that note, I was way under where I should have been, but I was close enough where it was like, ah, you got the timing right. <laughs> we'll still give you the points. Perfecto. <laughs> I love those notes. Come on, give me those air horns. I want the air horns. Yeah, there they are. Dun, dun. Well, hey. <laughs> oh, it's so intense. Oh, wait, that's not right. There is no way in hell that that is harder than Green Hill Zone. That chart was insane. I've been thinking I might have a go at modding a song into this game myself. The modding Discord seems really helpful. And I think one of the things that I really love about modding is that you kind of see how the game is put together. Every one of these songs has a .tmb trombone, like, readable file for the chart. Usually a video or just a PNG background. And the audio file. And because this game is made in Unity, that's the engine that I've been taught to work in. So I'm thinking... Maybe I'll have a go. And funnily enough, the game I was thinking of taking a song from was Xenoblade Chronicles. But that game has got some crazy music, so maybe I'll start off a bit smaller. What else can we get? Any Final Fantasy X heads in the chat? <laughs> In fact, this is the perfect time for me to use my new emote that I created. Yeah, baby. <laughs> oh, 07. I literally based the image off Big Boss himself. <laughs> Iconic. Yeah, come on, let's do some Final Fantasy. Let's butcher a gaming masterpiece. They do. They all have incredible music. Oh, hey, 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 whoa, whoa, hello. That wasn't very nice. I hate it when they start immediately like that. What is this? Okay, this is more like it.
<laughs> Beautiful. Not good. Okay, we've got another fast section coming up. The game really struggles with those really short notes. Like the timing is so weird. You've got to really hit it early. And yeah, there, that one, I was really early, but it didn't matter. It was like, yeah. <laughs> it's much easier to hit those longer notes because you've got more time to adjust your hands. I love it when they fade the music out and you're just left with whatever the fuck this is. <laughs> Come on! Ah, <laughs> oh. It's the recording curse. It's... I'm not fully warmed up. I'm getting all my Johns in. Just not playing as well as I usually do. Uh, and then how else can you follow up the Final Fantasy X battle theme than with the American National Anthem? <laughs> it's just the natural corollary. It's what you do. I'm very happy with that glide. I'm keeping this rainbow mode going for a while. Why do I say words? These song selections are all over the place. Bearing in mind, half of these songs are modded in. They're not actually in the game. <laughs> but yes, our, our selections are pretty wild. <laughs> I'm just being chastised by my uh, bot telling me that it's been enough time that I need to drink again. It's okay, I'm doing it. Are you happy now? That felt like an A. Come on, game. Give it to me. The good, the bad, and the ugly. I feel like Final Fantasy X has already got me... Uh, has got the mod muted. Mod muted? <laughs> the VOD muted. Because Square Enix are very uh, tight on their... They're basically the music industry, but for games.
In fact, this footage is definitely going to do it. Why didn't they tell me there was footage in this? Oh, it's an old film. Come on. Be cool, Twitch. Okay, this is cool. I like this. <laughs> oh, it's getting tense. Not good. Uh, help, this is going on for a while. Nice. Yeah, I'm stuck in B hell at the moment. That does tend to be my average. Yeah. And what else? <laughs> what else would you play after Good, Bad and the Ugly? But the Wii Shopping Channel theme. Now hear me out. They're both similarly iconic. Uh, has anybody watched any spaghetti westerns? So cruel. I cannot time these. For that one, I resorted to using the keyboard keys and, like, alternating. I still didn't even do it that well. Short no tell, yeah. Not good. Damn it. 
Yeah, yeah. In those bits, you really just need to get two keys on the keyboard and go... And pray that it doesn't get eaten up by, you know, the game thinking it's you holding down one. Yeah, who's played a... Who's played? Okay, sure. Who's played a Yakuza game? And also, yeah, who's watched a Spaghetti Western? Not so much a, a Western film guy. But I have watched... A couple of samurai flicks? Westerns basically derived from zap samurai films anyway. I really like uh, Seven Samurai by Akira Kurosawa. Yeah, I think <laughs> from Cowboys to the Yakuza, <laughs> let, let's play Bakamitai. A truly meme-worthy song. Oh, and this one's got its own video as well. I love it when they do this. Also, those lyrics, I toot for you. Here we go, guys. Dame done it. The photograph is of a trombone. <laughs> Got him. I lost the air horns at the very end. Beautiful. Used to watch a lot of John Wayne films as they were always on in the house. Yeah, that definitely feels like the kind of films, westerns, or like old war films that would be on in the background. <laughs> yeah, of like parents' houses, grandparents' houses. Okay. Yeah, moving on up. Steadily getting harder, feeling it <laughs> getting worse. Uh, but I also think I'm starting to warm up. So, this is from another one of the best JRPGs of all time. If you played Smash Brothers, you might recognize it. I'll be very impressed if you have played the game it's actually from, because it was never released in English. It's never translated officially. This is from Mother Free. This one makes a lot of sense, actually. <laughs> yeah, baby. 
And then lose it. Feeling good about that. Oh my god, is that it? Is that it? <laughs> Yes, release me from my tromboning hell. Nice. B hell. <laughs> this one's also from Yakuza. You see I've got a slight bias going on. The storm's getting quite bad. Oh gosh, wait a minute. Have I forgotten what's happening in the outside world? Yeah, yeah, no worries. Take care. I highly doubt that it's the storm that was making Tekken 7 not work before. I think that was definitely a video encoding issue. At least that's what OBS is telling me. But yeah, take care. Have a good one. See you around. Oh. Okay. Let's have another Yak as a song because I wear my biases on my sleeve. Yeah, see you next stream. Probably this is a rock song. <laughs> Oh, am I going to end it in rainbow air horn mode? I think I am. Yeah, baby. That was so much easier than <laughs> most of the songs we've been playing in the last five minutes. <laughs> Another classic. More wee beeps and boops. Got some very nostalgic beeps and boops. Does the Wii. Also, yes, can confirm. Trombone is spelt tr boon here.
<laughs> Very mean game. Is that it? Oh, that's actually it. <laughs> B. A. Just about A. Was that a high score? Yes, yes it was. Nice. Slight improvements. Uh, oh my goodness. Am I gonna be able to do putting on the Ritz? I can remember it now and just imagining it, you know we're just gonna be going it's going to be lots of jumping, lots of gliding in this. Let's see how it goes. Ugh. Mean! <laughs> nice. Oh, I think this just explains my life playing this game. Uh, new high score, very close to the last one. That seems to happen a lot with these modded tracks. You'll hit B, be like a like a millimeter away from A. What more do you want from me? Whoa, looking cool, Joker. <laughs> I've not actually played Persona 5 yet. The only Persona game I've played is free. Uh, I guess that makes me slightly hipster. And the true hipsters are the people who have actually played Persona 1 and 2. Because why would you do that to yourself? Okay, I've not played this track before. This is going to go badly. Let's -a go. Oh, God. Why am I playing the vocals? Uh, 
I hate my life. <laughs> Okay. Actually survived that with air horn. Nope, goodbye. <laughs> it was nice while it lasted. Nice. Uh, I wasn't imagining it. The trombone champ character was in the background, right? While Joker was dancing. <laughs> I honestly can't tell what's going on in the background half of these. He's so focused on hitting the notes. But yeah, A first try, that's pretty nice. It's always a lovely surprise when you try one of these modded tracks and you realize that you're playing the vocals when you thought, oh, maybe I'll be playing the bass. Damn you. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, mm, uh, but these are all from the actual game. Okay. Sugar Plum Fairy is pretty funny. <laughs> we can do that. Okay. To this day, scientists don't really know how a trombone makes sound. Even the base game is full of charm and fake trombone facts.
damn it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, nice. Again, there's no way that was harder than some of these like modded tracks that we played before. Um, <laughs> Stick a Bush Symphony. If you've played Donkey Kong Country 2, or if you've heard this song in Smash Brothers, you'll know it's an absolute banger. Doesn't translate too well to the trombone, funnily enough. Uh, also, check the the genre of music up here is monkey. Uh, that's definitely what it feels like to play. But let's give it a go. We're nothing if not masochistic here at Ludo Narrow Brits. I think this one stops really quickly. How am I supposed to react to those ones at the very beginning? even in the song. What is this? Yes, is that the end? Yeah, it is. <laughs> okay. B, yeah. <laughs> you can kind of tell by the speed it's going at the beginning where you're going to land. That, that was very mid, maybe above mid. Uh, I think Take On Me, as much as I love it, it's going to be a music video. So that scares me. It's going to be really interesting to see how much of this actually makes it into the VOD. <laughs> My PC is not powerful enough to stream this and record it at the same time, so wasn't even strong enough to handle Tekken 7 and streaming at the same time. So... But I think we should be safe with Fly Me to the Moon. Okay, yeah, that's what we're gonna do after I go to the loo. Skip to the loo, my darling. Right, I'll be back in a few minutes. Uh, maybe I'll subject you to an ad while I'm gone. <laughs>
Whoa! Uh... Game? Where are you? There we go. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. I forgot what the hell I was gonna say. My mind just completely drew a blank. So that's good. <laughs> let's go, let's go to the moon. Okay. <laughs> Hello, Frank. What are you doing down there? Okay, we got vocals. Mean. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> Toot. Oh, yeah. No way in hell that's making it into the VOD. Happy birthday. The Toot is a lie! Let's go. Surely you must have some portal heads in the chat. I only played Portal 2 for the first time very recently. Uh, the main campaign, I played co op.
<laughs> nice. <laughs> that was a very mixed bag. I felt like it sounded way better than it was score-wise, yeah. Maybe I was just playing too closely to the music. You know, kill me. <laughs> so I've never played RuneScape, and I'm quite proud of that fact. No, no, I... I'm worried that if I played RuneScape, that I might never stop. At the same time, lots of people I know who have played RuneScape have told me that if you want to level up to 100 in every single skill, you basically leave your game on for five weeks while your character just chops trees over and over again. Uh, and that drop rates in that game are not great. So I also feel like it might not be the game for me. But even I must admit, it's got some really catchy and memeable music. Ah, oh, this one is a goodie. Let's -a go. <laughs> yeah, in those really quick bits, I was just like hammering the keyboard. So like, how quickly can I get these notes out? Thorn it. Yeah, not my best, but incredibly catchy. Every time I hear that on somebody's streams, uh, it's stuck in my head for the next five days. Oh, 
No. <laughs> it is time. Uh, does this get muted on stream? Let's find out. <laughs> I like how you actually have to play the bass in this one. As opposed to the lyrics. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> very fun. Very good. Come on, give me an A. Give me an A. Why are you like this every time? Ah, uh, and it was a was a new personal best as well. Yeah, songs where you get to play the bass parts. A big fan, especially because it's it's easier. <laughs> you don't have so many quick toots that you got to mash out. Yeah, very nice. Never gonna give you up. Maybe not. That's definitely got a music video in the background. Tetris. We're getting into some real difficult territory now. So many of the modded songs are just brutally hard because, hey, why the hell not? These weren't made for trombone. Beautiful. That felt good. <laughs> give me an A. Give me an A. Give me an A. Give me an A. Yeah, baby. Close to being an S. I feel like 
A to S is a huge jump. Uh, you've really got to not drop combos there. Yeah, yeah. You've probably noticed while I'm playing this, but you can actually... You don't have to play every single note, like start a new note. You can blend two notes together. And the game won't give you a perfecto for it. I think you get locked out of perfecto. But I think you can still get nices and okays. So yeah, if you're struggling a bit and there's too much going on, you can just hold one note. But of course, then you can run out of breath. If you run out of breath, then you're frozen out for five seconds. It's pretty brutal. So yeah, it's some risk reward going on. The Wallace and Gromit theme. Fun fact, the university that I went to, uh, Nick Park, the creator of Wallace and Gromit, went there. His final grad project was a grand day out. And no one is interested. Charles. Yeah, if Lizzie's films that were always in the background of her family's house. Yeah, if that was John Wayne films, then Wallace and Gromit was always in the pod in the background of my household. Yeah, sure, why not? This one is gonna be a lot harder than it seems, right? It's Animal Crossing. Animal Crossing is nice and relaxing. No. No! <laughs> Damn it! Short notes. That's a B. That's a B if ever I've seen one. B hell. Yeah, Cerno, if you're still there. Sorry, I'm definitely stealing that B hell joke. I'm gonna clip the bit where I say B hell first. Then I'm gonna put it on TikTok with a bunch of bees coming in to swarm me. Now nah, I'll definitely credit you for the joke. <laughs> Do a little zoom in on the comment. Uh, I'm not doing Bob on Battlefield. 
That one is hard. I don't like it. Uh, Despacito. The Avengers theme is going to get struck. As will Despacito. This is Halloween, Will, for sure. And there's a video on in the background. Uh, the Entertainer. I remember this being where it really ramps up in difficulty. The Entertainer is in the base game. But let's see. Have I improved? I have not. Why? Suck. That's a C. Damn. That one is where tri trombone champ goes. Welcome to the those big steps. <laughs> Welcome to hell, son. Wow. Okay. But then Beethoven's fifth. I remember being a bit easier than that. Don't make me eat my words, game. Please. I think I may have opened my mouth a bit too soon there. Okay, yeah, better than the entertainer. <laughs> Still tough. Still tough. I'm not doing the Spider-Man 2 pizza theme! Ah, oh, screw it. You know I am. Oh, an absolute classic of a game. A real childhood favourite of mine. Thank <laughs> you. 
<laughs> Help! What is happening? <laughs> that one hurt. Oh, we're getting into the real bad lands of trombone champ difficulty here. And then I think of a song like the Luigi's Mansion theme, and I think, now that's way slower. That's got to be easy, right? Right? The trombone does not have any bones. Betrayal. This is funky remix. Uh-oh, what is this? <laughs> the Scar remix. Why? Why do you hate me? Ouch. Ouch, that one hurt. Oh god, it's still going. <laughs> yeah, I kind of had to drop that note there because it was way too long to do in one breath. Yeah, Luigi's Mansion. Easy song. <laughs> to be fair, it would have been easy had it not been a Scar remix. I kind of missed that one. Yeah. Oops. Um. Oh dear. How hard could the Legend of Zelda theme be? Really? Who?
<laughs> Great. Okay, fine, you can have that one. <laughs> Very good. Yeah, baby. That was much easier than freaking Luigi's Mansion. Oh. Uh, <laughs> okay, first of all, this song is a mess. It's a mess to play. Uh, there's no way that this doesn't get muted. The intro theme for Cowboy Bebop. <laughs> but it's so cool. It's so funky. So I'm going to do it. Don't say I, I don't do anything for you guys. <laughs> ah, this is going to go badly. solo oh my god stop help Still going!
<laughs> yeah, baby. <laughs> That one is so evil. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. So happy with a B there. It was my highest score so far, PB. We're working up. We're working towards A. Ah, uh, from one epic sax solo to another. Yeah, this is one of the funkiest tracks from Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. I haven't done this one before, let's do this. Surely it can't be harder than Tank. It's harder than Tank! <laughs> Why? Why do you hate life? One of the greatest innovations that modders have made to this game, besides just adding custom tracks, is uh, Auto Toot, uh, a bot, an AI that plays every note perfectly, no matter how quick it is. And some charts, some songs have been made so that they're only really possible when played by an AI. I think the the theme, the main theme to the original Doom is an auto toot song. I might show it after this, actually. <laughs> Just pop on YouTube and show you. Uh, don't stop me now. It's gonna. Can I do William Tell? Maybe. Again, this is another track that's in the base game. Can't be as hard as those naughty modders. Oh my god.
My mouse is slipping out of my hand. Wish I just crept over to 700,000. But yes, that is way better than the first time I played it. Woohoo! Charles is a happy boy. You knew it had to be in here. The first song I thought, besides Megalovania, which I thought I downloaded and added as a custom track. There might be something wrong in the folders where I added it. Go back and check. But yeah, after Megalovania, it was going to be One Winged Angel. Uh, oh no, Megalovania is there and it is the hardest song by far. <laughs> okay, right, that makes sense. Okay, let's do... Yeah, let's do Slider first from Super Mario 64. These are all just going to be a mess. One Wing Danger I've played a few times, and it's okay, but yeah, Slider and Megalovania are going to be a nightmare. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? That wasn't as bad as I thought. <laughs> That's got to be an improvement on my previous score. Yes, yes it is. I guess it helps that it's quite a short song as well. It's not too many places to make mistakes. Yeah. Okay. Because it's my favorite and it's absolutely going to get muted. Sorry, Square Enix. We'll leave One Winged Angel till last. Uh, we all knew it was coming. Yes, Nix the Shield, you are right. Doing the Lord's work. We all knew it was coming. It was only a matter of, t of when. Ah! I can only imagine how. It's bad, it's bad. It's hard. I don't like it. Oh. Look at my guy, he's going crazy! <laughs> oh! 
I'm impressed with the timing there. That wasn't too bad. Dun, dun. What is this? I'm getting way more of these notes than I thought I would. I hate everything now. <laughs> that was good. Yeah, B, I, I am just the most mid trombone champ player in existence. I cannot be stopped. Okay. You've all been waiting for it, and by you all, I mean me. This is my little tree. I get to play one winged, one winged angel. I get to get demonetized for it, and it's gonna to be totally worth it. One of the only songs that I've had muted in the past was one match of Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, where One Winged Angel was playing. Uh, it won't hit the same on, trom on Trombone Champ. Newt, come on. You clearly haven't seen this before. This is a treat. The, uh, the modder for this one has gone all out, and I will absolutely credit them. I'm going to have to put all the modders in the YouTube description for the VOD. Yeah, yeah. Uh, the PS1 original version of One Winged Angel got muted on my Super Smash Bros. Uh, stream a while back. So this version from Advent Children is absolutely uh, going to get struck. Oh, okay, let's go. Six minutes, a marathon. <laughs> Sephiroth has descended with his massive trombone. Okay, at least you get some rests in between. Hmm. 
Okay. <laughs> what is this? What is this? Got lazy. <laughs> it's so good. Oh. oh, so close to an A. I will get it. <sighs> yeah, that's my favorite modded song before. I am the famed, notorious Final Fantasy VII ap apologist. <laughs> no, apologist, I guess it's more being a normie. <laughs> Loving that game. Uh, it was about a month ago and like last year, October last year, they, Square Enix were doing the Final Fantasy VII remake orchestral tour and it came to London, uh, to the Royal Albert Hall and I went to it and yeah, they did so many songs. They had the vocalist come on and do that original track from 
FF7 and it was a FF7 remake. Uh, and they played Aeros theme and they were kind of teasing it for a while. Like, ah, oh, this is the end of the show, guys. I mean, sorry, we've got to leave. And then just when everybody thought the show was over, uh, they brought out One Winged Angel. <laughs> and yeah, I came a lot. <laughs> On that note, I leave you. <laughs> <laughs> Newt, have you been to any video game concerts? I definitely see ones for... I went to a Zelda one, but that was like a decade ago. That was like for the release of Skyward Sword? Which would have been the 25th anniversary? You haven't. Do you live in a place or near a place that often gets those kinds of shows. Guess I'm lucky because I live in London, like most of the big ones go around there. And also the UK is pretty small. You can get to London from pretty much anywhere in the country. So the main part of Trombone Champ is, you know, boning. But when you're done with that, I do live in a place where an event like that could happen. Oh, sweet. Yeah, definitely keep your eyes out for it then. <laughs> yeah, I get that. I, I tend to get most of them recommended to me through social media because the internet has sussed me out and I'm a victim of advertising. Yeah, when we looked at the menu before, you may have noticed this baboon feature. Aha. I've actually done everything I can with the baboon, but all of those toots that you earn for playing songs. Hello. <laughs> you pump them into this massive tuba. <laughs> th that's a tuba, right? And then after you finish that, you get this key. I still don't know what it unlocks. One of the really cute things about this game is that there's lots of like hidden things in the menus that you can click on. I wonder if it's in the credits. In advanced info. Is it in the baboon facts? It's a very important part of your game. Most game designers neglect the baboon facts but it is important. Oh, that's so cool. It breaks down all of the scores for you. Sweet. If I want to mod a track into this game, I'm probably going to have to pay attention to this, read up on it. <laughs> Overall note accuracy is what matters. Imagine you're trying to paint over each note as accurately as possible. This is really cool. This is really in-depth. And it like... <laughs> gets into game design more than like the average player would really want or need but for the people who want to go for those higher scores it's there it explains what's happening under the hood okay let's see is there anywhere i can use the key in the card collection uh yeah give me some sacks give me some loot boxes <laughs> What did I get? <laughs> oh yeah, there's like Yu-Gi-Oh references in here. So you can get a blue eyes white baboon and a red eyes black baboon. One of the most powerful trombona cards. <laughs> the red eyes black baboon. And a hot dog. 
simply holding one of these <laughs> use them with power. Getting some duplicates, but there is something we can do with those. We can give them to the devil, of course. Brass! <laughs> they have no idea where brass comes from. It's big names, Tchaikovsky, Mozart, Beethoven. That just means they're common, though. This where it all begins. Oh, we're still going. Paradise Black Baboon. Thank you, reminder. Whoa, now we're getting... <laughs> now we're getting better. The Trombona Cards card. <laughs> the trumpet, the coward's trombone. I love how all of the text in this game is written as if by a, <laughs> a downtrodden music student who swears that the trombone is the coolest thing ever. Yeah, a lot of character. Damn, we're doing well. And we've still got so many toots. But yeah, let's see if we can give anything to the devil. Hello. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, we can sacrifice some dupes to the devil. But he just wants things that I own one of. That's not fair. Maybe I'll open some more sacks off screen. Hmm. Yep, and that's Trombone Champ. I've done my duty to the world by showing off this game. You probably already heard of it, but yeah, didn't see its full capabilities, its potential with mods. But yeah, I'd say even if you're not modding the game, it's still pretty unique rhythm game. Got a brilliant sense of char oh, character behind it. Really full of charm. And the devs have stated that they're going to support this game for a long while. Extra music, more accessibility. Uh, options. The whole shebang, the whole, the whole trombone. So yeah, if this game looks like it would interest you at all, it's only on Steam, but it's on there for about £11, I believe is what I paid for it. Or whatever that converts to in your own currencies. <laughs> But yeah, we're talking an indie game price. Okay, so this has been me. This has been Tekken 7. <laughs> oh, geez. This is such a nightmare. I've really got to find out what's going on with... Yeah, the encoding issues I'm having. Because I want to play more Tekken 7 just in general, and this would be a really good excuse to do so. Like an anime training montage. And I can chart my progress with video evidence. But no, one day, one day it will happen. It might not happen until I get a new PC and then we're, um, <laughs> then we're playing Tekken 8. It's already out. Yeah, no, encoding issues. I, um, the game kept playing at 24 frames per second. It's never done that before when I've just had the game open. I've not been streaming on OBS. Uh, 
yeah, everything was just incredibly slow. And then I would go back to OBS and you'd get the little encoding uh, overload message. Still not really sure what to do about that beyond just lowering the bitrate, but I feel like I'm kind of playing with dark magic every time I do that. Yeah, I don't know if you've had any experience dealing with those. Got a surefire fix. <laughs> Bye-bye. Bye-bye, trombone champ. I will be back. Yeah, and this game is always going to get mods. <laughs> There's so many active people in that community. Just posting stuff every single day. Yeah. Encoding errors before, but it's been a long time. Yeah, I seem to get them pretty regularly with games that are a bit more graphically intensive. I'm only playing on, you know, a decently strong laptop after all. But I feel like that would explain the frame rate, but not the encoding issues i feel like that's a separate thing but yeah i can have a look at that but yeah that's kind of thrown the schedule up in the air a bit i wasn't expecting to be playing trombone champ today i don't know what i'll be playing in the future definitely gonna play some fall guys i want to find some more like multiplayer online games that you know there's no story to follow I can just kind of fall back on those games and play them for a couple of hours when I don't know what else to play. Also really want to do some co-op stuff with a couple of my friends. Uh, we played Phasmophobia for the first time yesterday and I freaking loved it. So I would love to do some of that. I don't care if it's past Halloween. But yeah, still early days. It's good to be back. And yeah, I'll have to pop into your stream at some point as well, Sir Newt. Who have we got to raid? Shall I have a look? Is anyone there? Is anyone there? Raid, raid, raid. Find a channel to raid. <laughs> Literally no one. Did I did I pick a bad time to stream or something? <laughs> okay, yeah, literally no one. Wow, that's sad. Okay, we'll do it in the future. Have a good one, everybody. Uh, keep boning. <laughs> and... I'll see you next time. Should be Friday. This week's going to be a bit weird because I've got a, a game narrative convention happening all weekend. But yeah. Best place to find out when I'm streaming, as always, it's on the Twitch page. So yeah. Have a good one, and I'll see you when I see you. Bye-bye. That's not the right one. <laughs> Take care, Sanoot.